Okay, let's work with some other tools. We'll do a couple stroke tools now, the line tool, and we'll work with the pencil tool, and we'll finish up our happy face. So we have a starting file here that we can open up. And let me just zoom in on our partially completed happy face. And I'll drag it over here again. I'm using the shift key to get the hand tool and and I use the zoom capability for our stage up here in the top right cor hand corner of the stage window. So we have the line tool which is a stroke tool and we have the pencil tool which is a stroke tool. So the line tool is straightforward and the idea of what it does. When we select the align tool and again we'll be in non-object mode. We'll work on object mode as a separate subject and you go anywhere on your stage and just hold the mouse pointer down and drag your mouse and you get a line in the direction you're going in and it's on a constraint basis uh, if you hold the shift key down. So if you hold the shift key down you can go guarantee you're going horizontally or at a 45 degree angle or vertically depending on what you want to do. You can extend and overlap and accomplish what you want. With strokes if you go to the selection tool and move it over top of a stroke you can bend them. And then you can try to accomplish some uh, modification to a stroke to come up with a specific look and feel. All right, the pencil tool, let me select that. Uh, we get a modifier down here which gives us the sensitivity of it to the movements of the mouse. Either it's going to try to straighten out the mouse moves, smooth them out, or the idea here is, is to closely map them. All right, so right now it's on smooth. And what I want to do is with the pencil tool, in this case, I want to drop the zoom. Uh, you should know that the zoom, uh, when you're using zoom, it will affect uh, the way things work. Uh, zooming in gives you more precision on doing things, and that's an important part of working with graphics tools is zoom. Zoom is a, a real friend, so if you zoom in. so uh, And also, the thickness of the stroke will change on how things work. I'm going to go back to a 1. And for my stroke on the pencil tool and I'll stick with the black color and I'm with smoothing and so and then I'll just draw on the stage and, and kind of make some bends and turns and you can see my mouse is not perfectly straight uh, or steady and you can see it smoothed all those bumpy edges out. I make a right turn and we'll honor that bend a little bit on the turn and we'll curve it. So we'll go over to straighten mode and I'll make some of those turns. See almost we can get a perfect corner. And then I'll do some curvy things. And you can see the little sharp bends it's trying to straighten out the movements and then uh, we'll use the ink. And the ink, again, will follow these lines along here. And it almost looks the same, but if you look closely, you can see there's uh, more uh, detail involved here. All right, and if we zoom out, you might even see that a little bit more. Okay, hold the shift key down and bring that back into view. And you can grab the selection tool and select all these guys. Well, before I select them all, let me just uh, take some of these overlapped ones and, and use the selection by clicking and seeing how it grows. See, so as you click in, it it trying to follow the, along and adds to the selection. So you have to get used to that uh, sequential clicking that uh, gives you the ability to select uh, complex strokes. Select them all, hit delete. Okay, so I'm going to take the line tool and let's bump the stroke up to four. Let's go over to our happy face. I'm going to draw a line somewhere down where our mouth might be. Go to the selection tool. Go somewhere in the middle of the line tool and bend it. 
And now I got my happy face. Or my smile, I mean. And you can adjust it around in different directions. You want to throw some eyebrows in there, you can again use this and try a couple of eyebrows. And now it's up to your graphic intention what you'd like to accomplish. So we now have our happy face and uh, I'll throw a nose in there and we're pretty much done.